Welcome back to Latin Nation. I'm your host, Humberto Guida. Patricia Regan is one of the few Latin American female directors working in Hollywood. The Mexican-born filmmaker has made a name for herself in the male-dominated field with breakthrough hits like Under the Same Moon, The 33, and the recent hit Miracles from Heaven. But it's her work behind the scenes as a detailed perfectionist that has given Regan her rise to the top of the movie industry. Now here is the fourth amiga among those great Mexican directors, Patricia Regan, right here on Latin Nation. Hi, uh, my name is Patricia Regan and I am a film director. And I recently released Miracles from Heaven, that's my last movie. Cheers! Cheers! Today let's do Benjamin Franklin. An investment in knowledge pays the best interest. I feel that it's been a, a desire of Hollywood for a long time to tap into the Latino market and to make movies with the Latino subject, but I don't think that it has been achieved yet. It's been going on, there's movies that come and go. I think my, one of the first movies that succeeded doing that was my first movie, Under the Same Moon, La Misma Luna. I think it really proved to people in Hollywood that you know, the Latin market exists and that you know, people come out and go to the theaters. There's a studio called Pantelion that is doing, you know, a, an effort constantly um, to bring, you know, this kind of movie to the audience and learning about the audience. But I think it just can't be one studio. I think every studio and more efforts have to be done to really create, you know, that wave that we need. Oh, no, baby! When Anna got sick, I just couldn't understand it. Why was this loving little girl going through this? I think your daughter is lactose intolerant. Acid reflux. Everything looks OK. Everything's fine. Everything is not fine. Well, Miracles from Heaven is what they call a faith-based movie. So yes, it's niche, but what kind of niche? A huge one. Right now, it's one of the biggest audiences in the country. Um, these movies are highly successful. I believe Miracles from Heaven is one of the most successful films this year um, for Sony. Unfortunately, the tests confirm that she's very ill. There is currently no cure for Anna's condition. Doctor, please, this is our little girl. And I was able to bring, you know, a new kind of character to the screen that we're not necessarily used to seeing in Hollywood films. You know, in Hollywood films, the Latinos and particularly the Mexicans always fall into, you know, the, the lower characters, you know? Either the bad guys with guns or, you know, the service people. Um, so I thought it was just very interesting to have the top doctor of the country be a Latino guy, you know, and show the American audience that we Latinos, you know, are in every part of the society in really important jobs helping the U.S. I think that as a director of, you know, Mexican heritage and, and living in the U.S., I want to do both. I want to do movies. Um, where I can bring the kind of stories that I, where I come from, and also make movies, general, you know, mainstream movies, but always bringing my sensitivity, you know, that's what I think makes us different. Yeah.